Hi, this is Shane Spiel, and I'm going to show you a couple of my tricks for playing a diddly bow. This is a one-string diddly bow, one-string cigar box guitar. Uh, there's a lot of different ways to make these. Um, this is the type that I sell at my concerts, and basically I use boxes that are too small for a regular cigar box guitar, and I use my leftover lumber and leftover parts to make my one string diddly bows. Uh, they're fully playable and uh, I always like to show people uh, a basic and easy way to get started because these things are fun. Um, so I'm going to give you this, this lesson, we'll call it the magic note of diddly bow. We're going to find that magic note. I have this tuned to a G because I have a G string on there. doesn't matter if yours is tuned exactly to mine, just stick along with me and, and you'll figure this out. I'm sitting here and I'm playing this open string. I have my three quarter inch socket as my slide. And um, I want to get that magic note that I'm talking about. So on, this, on the neck of this guitar, I'm going to start by playing, using my ear, I'm going to play Smoke on the Water. And I, it, it'll take you, if you're not used to playing guitar, it'll take you a while to figure it out. But Smoke on the Water sort of goes like this. Now the reason we're starting with smoke on the water is we want that very first note that we hit with the slide. Right there. Dun, 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 dun. Right there. We're going to hold that slide right where it's at. And I'm going to take a pencil and I'm going to mark right there. Because that right there, people, is the magic note. Now watch this. If we play no other note on this one string, except for open and the magic note it is all you need to get funky and to play some you know deep fun blues now watch this I'm gonna just keep hitting this right there okay rhythm going and these these guitars almost end up like a percussion instrument and a lot of the kids back in the depression era would use it as such and they would start scatting their jump rope songs I mean this is something that my friend one string Willie taught me um, take children's songs jump rope songs those little chants and uh, start singing them over a, a chugging rhythm where you use the open note and you use the magic note right there and watch this. Well, three, six, nine, the goose drank wine. The monkey chewed tobacco on the streetcar line. Line broke. The monkey got choked and he all went to heaven on a little rowboat. So, here's the neat thing about that magic note is if you wanted to change the tuning of your guitar you could take it down and the magic note would still be correct for that tuning so we got oh three six nine the goose drank wine the monkey juice tobacco on the street tie line line bro monkey got choked and they all went to heaven on a little road oh. so there you go there's a great way to start uh, I suggest looking up songs like the clapping song by Shirley Ellis, um, finding the lyrics for that. Uh, Lead Belly's song Black Betty even works on this. Oh, Black Betty and Bam -a Lamb. Oh, Black Betty, Bam -a Lamb. Black Betty had a child. Bam -a Lamb, damn thing went wild. Bam -a Lamb said it won't none of mine. Bam -a Lamb, the damn thing went blind. Bam -a Lamb, oh. Black Betty, Bam Lam, oh Black Betty, Bam Lam. So there you go. There's the magic note. Just two notes playing back and forth, open and on the magic note, and then you've got your scatting instrument. Look up. Uh, oh yeah, other song lyrics would include um, "Mary, Don't You Weep," and uh, look for old prison chant songs from the Depression era. So there you go, one string diddly bow, there's your first lesson, the magic note. Get out there, get playing, enjoy these instruments. Thanks.